Hello and welcome everyone. Uh, welcome to uh, like me trying to do competitive, I guess. <laughs> so Sword and Shield is out for. Uh, oh my God, are you serious? Again? Oh my God. Uh, uh, all right, take two. <laughs> it's time for the moment you've been waiting for. Da. So as you all know, we still don't know what the uh, VGC rules are, which is whack. Uh, but like, I they are definitely contemplating to do it, maybe to do it a three season style like they did previous season, where they one season they won't allow Dynamax, then they'll allow Dynamax, and then they'll allow Gigantam Gigantamax, stuff like that. Uh, today we just have a rental team, and I want to try. Uh, get a little better at this as well so I'm using a rental team for now but like I'll uh, I am making I'm in the process of making my own teams as well All right I'm already tier, tier 4 that's great nice all right uh, but yeah we've got two rental teams from Hibiki uh, VGC all wait, just a sec. here is his Twitter of course uh, where you can find the teams as well with this code, um, do give him a follow. A great VGC player, so definitely worth to follow. So please, please, please follow him. But yeah, today we're using just sand because sand seems to be like the best weather up till now. Because you've got Excadrill, which is absolutely amazing, and yeah, there's no denying about it. It's really, really good. Um, for the rest, yeah. I don't know, it has Tarantar, Rotom Heat, uh, Milotic as well. Milotic now gets a healing move as well, which gives uh, you the ability to heal your uh, your partner Pokemon as well. We are called Life Dew, which is, which is actually kind of great for situations. Uh, Rotom is really great for to Dynamax him, and as well as Tarantar is also great uh, to Dynamax as well, because like both these Pokemon are really good. Um, but like the biggest Dynamaxer here, yeah, you can, we can use on this team is Excadrill. Excadrill is choice banded with uh, Sand Rush, which means normally he would be locked in a move. But thanks to uh, Dynamaxing, you can actually negate the you can negate the choice item and just choose another move to use. So it's not too bad at all. Ah, there's an opponent. All right, let's see what we get. Right, we're up against the rank two, which is fine. Let's see. All right, he brought rain. Um, not the greatest for me. Got choice. Uh, him on top is gonna be helpful here. We definitely. Want, um, we just don't want him to set, be able to set up his stuff. Uh, Tarantar is faster than the thingy, mm, highly likely. Uh, hit on top as a fake out is always great. Alright, let's try this. <clears throat> no, I'll, no idea how this all will go, but we can try, right? Barascuda is also very interesting because like it's already pretty fast, but thanks to its Swiss swim, it gets way faster. If I believe, uh, level 168, so it's 115 base speed. If I'm not wrong, well, we'll see. <laughs> I love that. Love the trader cards in this game. Honestly, it's so much fun. Oh, so he's using a rental team as well. Mm 
I'm just gonna switch the excavator to Gurkis and just I'm gonna post combat the <coughs> Ferrothorn, expecting it to want to leech it or expecting it to switch out from the well, fake out. Maybe switch out. I don't know what he's gonna do, but I don't wanna risk my excavator here. Alright, that's gonna be Pelopper then. Yep. Alright, so what's important as well is that uh, speed stats are now calculated differently. So that means because of the rain, it's now up. The Ludicolo is the fastest thing on the field. Alright, you see a skull come out. Oof, burned. Right, we do get managed to get a close combat off. Did a chunk, but not enough. Uh, the burden is unfortunate on Tonkis, but we can um, we can just air slash the uh, Ludicolo, cool, just try and kill it off. Because honestly, that's the biggest threat. We do manage to lift uh, Hurricane normally from this Pelipper, as long as it not, isn't Specs. Okay, let's see. Skull on the Hypnotom this time. Alright, is he focusing twice on the... yeah. He's going fully for the hit on top. Alright, alright, alright. We can just chip a bit. That's good damage. Right, now we can uh, put in the Tarantar, put up the sand. And kill off the... Uh, kill off the Pelipper. Cause that's the main thing that puts up the rain as well. Ferrothorn is kind of scary right now, but we do have a few tools like the Choice Band X-Drill will do a lot of damage as well. I'm completely to follow me, honestly. I'm, I'm going for air slash, but let's see air slash and then let's go for rock slide. Hopefully, killing off the Ludicolo and the Pelipper. All right, retreating the Pelipper. Good play on his part because he wants to keep that. And there comes the Ferrothorn. Let's see. All right, he's just gonna Dynamax the Ludicolo. Apparently, that's gonna be. Big, strong, it's Ludicolo. Alright, that's good chip. And now Ludicolo goes for a max overgrowth. Alright, on the turn there. See, alright, we live, we managed to live, that's great. Grassy Terrain is up as well. See if this yes we get the uh, Ludicolo goes down. That's really great for us. All right. So we've got life do on the Tokyo, so we might, we can heal the Tarantar a bit back. Getting rid of the Dynamax is really good. Uh, Tarantar not dying is even better, honestly. Let's see, what does he switch into? Pelipper, yeah. I could Dynamax myself and put up uh, Sand and heal. Uh, heal Tarantar. Mm -hmm. Thinking about it. Does he's definitely. No, I don't want. I don't want Dynamax. I'm uh, just follow me. So they both focus me, so I can go to my Excadrill and try to set up my sand again. Because the Pelipper will go first, will probably scald me. Oh, protect, alright, alright, alright. 
So that means the Ferrator is definitely. Yep. All right, that's great. We still live. That's great. And now there's a choice bandit Excadrill on the field, which is even better. Uh, you can just air slash the the thing me jingy. All right, I'm contemplating. Do I just Dimax Rock Slide? No. Ground move. Wait, what does Dynamax Ground move do again? Sorry, I always don't. Uh, ally Special Defense Stab. Mm, not the best. But it's Stab. How much base is it? 130. Right, no, let's go for it. Let's go for Max Quick on the Ferroton. For Choice Bat. Oh no, because I'll lose my Choice Bat when I'm doing. I should have just earthquaked. Alright. My bad. Alright, he did switch out the Pelipper, which is actually really surprising to me because I thought he was definitely gonna try and save that. So I'm just gonna click this, thank you. Damage the Ferrothorn as much as I can. That's some good damage right there. We raise this but I have a pool keys, I guess. Alright, goes for Tailwind. Okay, so he tries to be faster as well. Let's see what the uh, Ferrothorn does. Oh, wait, first Air Slash. I'm still faster. Alright, that's great. Pookies is still faster than the Ferrothorn. This is really great for me. He put up Tailwind, that means he is faster. So I can now follow me with two hookies uh, and just use my rock move with Excadrill so I can get back up my Sandstorm as well. So that will help greatly. Right. So hopefully he just kills the two hookies. Yep, go. Alright, that means that Pelipper is gonna die right now. And I'm gonna set up my Sandstorm as well. Power Whip won't kill uh, my Excadrill. Nice, 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 nice. Sandstorm is up. Uh, Ferrothorn will be able to move, but I'm wondering what he will do. Power whip. All right, that's not gonna kill me. Oh my god, that did a lot though. Oh yeah, grassy terrain, of course. That actually helped him. All right, but we've got Tarantar in. Uh, let's see what this last mom is. If it's size me toad, we can just. Oh no, it's Barascuda. Barascuda is faster than anything on the field right now because of Tailwind. Um, so if he wants to kill me, he can. Uh, I believe I have to go for the Barrascuda as well. Don't think I'm in a winning position here. Um, what turn does Tailwind? So you used Tailwind previous turn, right? No, turn out before that. Means last turn of Tailwind. So I could protect with X. Uh, with Tarantar. No, because the Barracuda is still faster than me. Uh, ba -da -ba -da -ba -da -ba -da. Yeah, go for Barracuda. So he kills one of us. Yep, who is he killing? Alright, Tarantar. Right. I did have Fire Punch on that Tarantar, which is unfortunately uh, went for that. So all I have to do is hope that he misses a power whip. <laughs> so I go for Max Quake, killing off this Barascuda. Hopefully he misses his power If he misses his power whip, we win. If he hits, yeah, it's GG. He won. Of course, when I start recording, I lose. Ah, it ha oh, nice. That's a well played game. Uh, what I could have done different maybe is... With the tokis uh, used uh, life do before, I should have maybe to heal the Tarantar back again. Uh, first loss. That happens. We're all learning here.
All right, let's do another one. So yeah, um, but I want I want to do okay. So let's do the slash. Oh, that was AV. That is so much my air slash. All right, live orb, bright powder. Hmm, thing. All right, thunder as well. Oh yeah, thunder. I can see that. There's no way. That's why I did so much. Choice band. That is amazing. All right, cool. All right, yeah, let's do another one. Uh, I just wanna like get onto competitive. I am also gonna like organize a few uh, tournaments here in Belgium as well, uh, VGC tournaments. I got my judge, I got my organi uh, I got my organizer. So I really wanna try and make a competitive scene here in Belgium again because it's been a while. It's been a hot minute, and yeah, I just wanna be able to. Uh, Proudly present the Belgian VGC community, you know? Yeah. Alright, let's see. Moldy, rank 4. Alright, he has sand as well. This time with an Umbreon. Um, Ludico is probably only there uh, normally for the rain, so that's great. Mm. I'll need my Lotic as well. Uh, lead with Rotom. Let's bring hip on top. And Escadrill is always good for damage. We don't need to bring Tarantara always because that's a good thing about Dynamaxing. You can put up your own sand. Uh, Escadrill is already relatively fast. That's great for him. He also has his own Tarantara, so it's good to mix it up sometimes. And honestly, I personally, I hope the VGC meta will go in seasons. So first season, no Dynamaxing yet, uh, which I would love because like that's really, really interesting. Uh, let's see, show me. What a beast, 14, all right. With the epic music of Rose coming up, you already know. All right. Bring it on, muchacho. Right, so he leads with Ludicolo and the Gyarados. That means he's gonna put up, try to put up green on it for his Gyarados. There goes my competitive though. That's really great. He's probably faking out my Rotom and Max Air Streaming, uh, I believe. Let's see. Uh, for my speed, 151 speed, so that means. I will outspeed him, but uh, he's probably going for the max air stream. So I'm just gonna volt switch. Uh, if he doesn't do that exactly, his Gyarados will probably die. I'm fairly fast Rotom, uh, Rotom heat, so really helps. Uh, Ludicolo is of course scary in the rain. I forgot about. Uh, yeah, let's see. Yeah, all right. Dy no Dynamax tool from the from the uh, Gyarados, so that mean he means he's probably just going to waterfall me. Which is gonna hurt like a bitch. Oh, a check button. Oh, no. oh my god! Because my my Lolik was faster, he is he is forced to switch out. Let's see, it's Umbreon. So this time I'll flinch. Which is fine. Uh, let's just sculpt the Noctail. I am just gonna Volt Switch on the Ludicolo this time. Alright, so red. Uh, Ejig Button Gyarados. That's kind of interesting, honestly. I love the root on cameras and stuff, man. Like this interaction with the game, it's amazing. I really like it. And the crowd in the back. All right, so he's dynamaxing. What is he dynamaxing? Uh, I'm probably guessing on the Ludicolo. It is the Ludicolo. Yep. All right. So if he goes for a uh, max water move, he will put up his own rain. Oh, 
I am faster still. That's great. That's the good thing about an offensive Rotom. Pulse Switch did a chunk. Uh, I'm just going hip on top because hip on top can live uh, by far any move. And with fake out pressure as well, it's really great. And you're able to close combat the Umbreon helps as well. Right, let's see how much this gold does. That is some damage. Right, Citrus Berry. Snarl? Oh no no no. You raised my you raised my special attack again. What are you doing? I am using my white herb though, which I normally use for the close combat and stuff. Alright, so it's max overgrowth, let's see how much it does. We we managed to live. That means we can still uh, hit something very hard with the Milotic. We know we can't fake out Dynamax Pokemon, so that's fine. Uh, but like, because he's done that, we can see Grassy Terrain now with Grassy Terrain, he will certainly kill me. It will definitely kill me. Uh, but what I can do, because my Melodic is one of the fastest things here is on the field, weirdly enough, I can I am able to recover. I'm actually even. Hmm. I can live then, and I can uh, damage the hit on top instead. Uh, no, do some damage with hit on top on the Ludicolo. Because the Ludicolo actually needs to go. <laughs> oh, that's gonna intimidate me. That's actually a very good play by him. I'm gonna recover for one turn. Let's see what he does. But my hit on top is faster too. What the hell? That's a really bulky Ludicolo. Also, hella scary how he's looking. <laughs> right, Max Overgrow with the Grassy Terrain will do about 70 to 80. Won't kill. Which is really great for us. And his Dynamax will end next turn as well. So that means because my Lotic is faster and the Hypnotop is faster. Uh, with the damage that we're, uh, with the damage output that we're doing, means that we can actually kill the Ludicolo as well. Uh, let's see. I'm just going for a close combat on the Noctali this time. Icy Wind might kill the Ludicolo. I'm at plus three though, and it's a 60 base move. I don't know. It might. It might. Uh, like Dynamax is really weird for me. Nice. Alright, definitely didn't kill. My bad. <laughs> oh yeah, I lowered its speed earlier, that's why it's slowed and everything. Oh, that's just damage. Oh my god, did I get a crit? No, that was a crit. Crit would have killed. So he is able to kill my, off my uh, my Lotic, which is fine. I still have other options. So the Ludicool is gonna become smaller. I can go to my Rotom now. Because I can Volt Switch again. I believe the Noctali will probably... I can just discharge. Yeah, I'm on discharge. I'm gonna switch to Excadrill. Hopefully we are able to pick up two KOs. Would be great if we did. Ah, oh, I love this awesome music, man. So cool. I love this game. This game has been very pleasant for me. And I love seeing these battles. In glorious, glorious HD. Alright, all eyes, let's see. So that is on the X-Grill, but that's fine. We still have a choice band for a reason. 
this. Charge you! Ah, easy bake oven, and the Gyarados is gonna come in as well. Uh, and the last Pokemon, what will it be? Will it be the Tyranitar? No, probably not. Not Tyranitar. So that's the Gyarados. Oh, double intimidate. Alright, alright. I can switch out the Hitmon Top though. Wait, he's gonna. Ah. Oh. He's gonna just fake me out. The biggest threat to that team is probably the Rotom as well. I can't protect with Excrew, which is a bit unfortunate. But I can go to my own Hitmon Top. And I think my best move is the Max Rocks Fall on the Gyarados just to damage it as much as possible. I am minus 3, alright. That's a bit annoying, but it's fine. Yeah, let's get this Intim Intimidate as well. Look at all doing, doing the Carlton. Right. Allow me, good sir. There we go, big boy, big mole boy. Uh, this will probably do around 30 on the Gyarados, because like, I'm minus 3, but I'm still choice banned. It's a 1, uh, I believe it's 130 base move still. That's fine. Oh my god, that is still a bit a lot. Even at minus three, fucking Escudrill is a god. Hydro? It's special? Alright. Did not expect that. So now I'm just able to fake out the Leviator and just go for some damage on the Capoeira. Which will lower its special defense. No, it will raise my special defense if I go for a uh, ground move. Grass is gone, which is fine. So now we just fake out the Gyarados. And we just uh, max. No, you know what? What does uh, Steel do again? It raises allies' defense stats. That's actually. Might be better in this case for the hit on top. Uh, and us able to survive a move. Yeah, let's go for the max Steel then. Because like close combat won't kill the extra because thanks to Dynamaxing, which is still broken by the way, <laughs> we are able to survive a close combat. And now definitely we are defense boost. I am minus three. Alright, I have a choice bet. I agree there. But like I am minus three attack. And I still do so much damage. Like Oof, Excadrill is like the big winner here. Yeah, this is game. But let's just kill him. Go for the max quick. Yeah, there we go. Alright, so one and one. That's great for us. Uh, but we are. But we are gonna do one more, last one. I hope you guys enjoy this game as much as I do, because fuck man, I love it. <laughs> yes, I want to continue battling. All right, we're doing one more with this team. I hope I'll be able to soon get like, my own team and try out my own stuff, uh, because I'm very doubtful about a lot of stuff. I'm not sure what to use yet, but that's fine. All right, let's see. All right, rank four. Oh no, let's check first. Alright, that's... I have no idea what the Dragon Boy does. The, the second one. Alright, so I probably will edit that out, but like, I had, I didn't need be, I was able to pick my Pokemons. Uh, cause, oh, I was being yelled at. 
Like I have to go do something. But let's hope this goes fine. <sighs> Alright, so Pelipper goes first, thankfully. So my Sentry goes next second. Uh, the Rillaboom can just fake out. Ah, <sighs> oh, I actually ran. Fucking. Alright, we're all. We'll go Rotom with the Tyrantar. And then just Dynamax and Max Flutter by on the Ape. Because we don't. We really, really, really don't want to get faked out. There we go. So sometimes turn one uh, Dynamax can work well, uh, which is great. So I didn't bring Torkid, which is unfortunate. I wanted to bring some other stuff as well, but <sighs> it's all right. Let's do this. Let's try and do it without even picking our team. <laughs> let's be amazing players. Right. Yep, yeah, fake out doesn't work then. Able to do our max flutter V and just kill off the ape. Oh, that feels great. Let's see. I'm probably guessing that Pelipper went for Tailwind, if anything. Honestly, I'd say that's his best move as well. Yep. Uh, I don't remember his team, so I'll have to look into that. But yeah, that's how you learn the hard way. Uh, you just gotta, yeah, fake out can be negated, which is fucking broken. <laughs> it's honestly like it's no okay. What? I still don't know what that is. Uh, electric ice. So I can just ground move it then. I guess. I don't know how fast it is or anything, so I'm just, yeah, let's just grab move it, I guess. All right, Pelipper, Lee's, who comes in? Lantern. Oh, we Volt Switch that. All right. Just max earthquake. Let's see if this kills. Oh, that's disgusting. It just killed. Now it's for death rises as well. Is this game over in three turns? Alright, Volt Absorb. Yeah, it's not Lightning Rod, so I can still attack the Pelipper. Oh no, wait, he's gonna put up his range, so my Excursor is gonna be slower. No! Wait, I can switch in my turn, Tardo. Which is fine, cuz speed stats get calculated during the turn so switches like this will be very important in VGC uh, so we can just uh, bu -bu 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 yeah so we can just switch to Tarantar put up the sand extra will be faster yet again and we can just uh, kill off uh, lantern that's more annoying which is whack but like it's cool I love it, I love it, I love it, I love it. I this, this, like... No, we don't even need to pick our team to win. What the, what the hell is up, yo? It's just, why did that just work? Oh. Alright, we do know that Lantern gets a lot, a lot of HP. Uh, I believe it was 160, but I'm not sure who quote me on that. I'll just look a bit. Lantern. 125 HP. God, he might actually survive this. Or not. Because <laughs> look at the defenses. That's kind of AS. It's 58 defenses only. That's not really great. But then it's only the developer. Look at that beautiful explosion. Hydro pump. We are Tarantar, that will kill us. Exactly. 
and this seems like a 4 0, honestly. And now we're back to regular. We can't switch moves anymore, but we can still pick our first move, which is gonna be a rock slide. So, rock slide again, rock slide to the win, rock, 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 rock slide. Match is cancelled. That means we win the winner of today. Us. Let's go, us. I didn't even have to pick a team. What the fuck? That's funny. All right, guys. Uh, I hope you guys did enjoy that. I am uh, doing my best to get on top of this gen. Uh, I, there's a lot of stuff I want to do. I want to do VGC. I want to do maybe a bit of TCG as well. But like, I want to try and do something with the channel as well and with Twitch. So if you should be watching this, uh, I have a Twitch as well. I stream there more than I make videos, as you probably have seen. But uh, nonetheless, I would appreciate you guys support please leave a like if uh, you're able to do that and like i don't know show this to your mother maybe she'll like it as well maybe she likes pokemon but yeah that's it uh, yeah see you all the next time hope you enjoyed